Good morning. I'm John Perkins with your opening market minute. Soybeans, corn, and wheat are all up modestly in the early going on Wednesday with beans in the lead. Unknown destinations bought about 295,000 tons of U.S. soybeans today, offsetting a cancellation of more than 600,000 tons by China. The trades continue to keep an eye on the weather with both corn and soybeans in critical phases of development. USDA's next set of production numbers are out on September 12th. As for wheat, pretty much an oversold bounce at this point. The global supply remains very bearish. Live and feeder cattle are mixed, mostly lower ahead of widespread direct cash cattle business this week. Fed cattle exchange results are due out later today. This week's offering is a little more than 1,000 head. And hogs are lower under pressure from yesterday's lower move in the pork carcass cutout value, including a more than $12 drop in the pork belly primal. Cash trade the day is called $1 to $2 lower on the increase in market ready numbers. The average Iowa Southern Minnesota hog weight was steady with last week, but up more than two pounds from last year. I'm John Perkins with your opening market minute.